all right? You're an entrepreneur. And let me just say this one last thing about other people's money. There is this concept amongst poor people, all right? And I do not say that in a derogatory way. It's just that we have poor people in life, in the world. And the lower socioeconomic realm believes that using other people's money is not good. That my grandmother used to believe that if you had a mortgage on your home, that that wasn't cool. All right. Um, that if you did not own your own car, that that was not cool. That if you borrowed money from the bank to expand a business, that was not cool. But you see, if you go up the socioeconomic level and you start to deal with the affluent part of the world's population, they never use their own money. Never, ever, ever. Their own money is protected. Their own money is reserved on the side. Every, every chance they get to use your money over their money, they're gonna take that. Do you think some wealthy real estate mogul is gonna take his own money? and buy all the property he needs for the next project? No, he's gonna put a little, he's gonna put as little of his money at risk on the line and use his reputation and all of the successes of his past real estate deals to get the biggest, fattest loan from a bank so that he can expand his business, all right? Do you think a hedge fund, all right, uses all of its own money? No, it attracts the money from other billion dollar organizations and individuals and uses their money to make investments in the markets all over the world. No one at the high echelon uses their money. And when I hear this idea that I don't want to use Oliver's money, I know it comes from the poverty level of thinking. The rich people, wealthy, affluent people use other people's money and they protect their own money. All right. And so you've got to get away from this idea that no, 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 I want, it, I want it to be my money because that's low. It's the lowest. It's you're you're still operating on the lower rungs of the financial ladder. The higher you go, the less of your money that you use, you use leverage up the wazoo. All right. And that is what allows a talented individual who is using the leverage to expand beyond the capabilities of his own money. You want to expand beyond what you have. You want to be, expand beyond the capabilities of what you have. And the only way to do that is to use OPM, other people's money.